Hi everyone, Lori Marie here, Mixed Media Artist in Vallejo, California. The sun is setting on this gorgeous cold and rainy day here in Vallejo, California. Thank you so much for joining me. I haven't been on the table for a little while. Well, I've been on the table. I just haven't taken you on the table with me. <laughs> I am so busy, gratefully, purging, and I am so busy, gratefully, uh, creating purge books, the junk journals, the uh, traveling collage books. I'm absolutely having a blast. The dining room table is filled with papers. I'm taking them, I'm folding them, and I am making the books. So thank you for your orders. I also want to take an opportunity to say Merry Christmas and Happy New Year and whatever holidays that you celebrate. Uh, many, many holidays to celebrate and be grateful for our loved ones. Uh, many of you have sent Christmas cards to the Jenkins family. Thank you for that. And many of you have given gifts, uh, monetary gifts, uh, to our channel, to our village, to our relocating fund. And I am so touched, and I appreciate that so much. So thank you to all of you that have done that. Uh, there are many, many, many of you that have done that, and I so appreciate it. So uh, most of the little books have been sent off. I do have a couple that are uh, ready to pop over to the post office tomorrow. I have one um, of the purge books right here. It's... Uh, I'm having fun not thinking about it too much, just grabbing something and playing with it. So this is a children's board book, uh, pages out of a children's board book. I cut the cover in half and created the junk journal inside. Very fun. I have a few more pages of that that I can play with. Rob's sister is coming tomorrow, um, so I have to clear off the dining room table. So I'm going to be um, folding and make creating uh, signatures tonight. This video is about how to do the uh, Coptic binding with signatures. I wanted to do it. I have not known how to do it. I was intrigued by a little book that was made for me that was uh, Coptic binding with these itty bitty little signatures. And I thought, how? Can that happen? Because I've all, always known how to just do it on the flat pages. So I, I found a video, watched the video, and I'm just like, yeah, that still does not make sense to me. So I've gone off the rails, and I have figured out a way to do it that works in my book that is very similar to how I do the Coptic binding. Uh, it's actually easier than uh, the Coptic binding with the flat pages. I found it easier. Uh, I can do it without the instructions. What? <laughs> Crazy. So, uh, yeah, you know, we're getting there. We are getting there. Uh, there's less and less in the studio. It's funny because I'll move something, I'll purge something, and then there will be something behind it. <laughs> it's like, oh my gosh. <laughs> but it's happening. So thank you for your patience and all of your support around that. Rob leaves on January 8th to go to Costa Rica for two weeks. And uh, isn't that exciting? So once again, thanks for coming along. Thank you for coming along on the table with me. Thank you for your patience while I played on the table figuring out some things so that I could show you. And thank you for the support while we are uh, getting ready to relocate. And I will still be making art videos. They will be different. They will be different because my supplies will be different in Costa Rica. But I will have a table, I will have my camera, and we will still play together. And on that note, see on the table. Our project today is a Coptic binding uh, with signatures. This is a traveling collage book. Yum, 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 yum. It comes with a glue stick and some goodies to put into the pages. Um, but uh, the, main, the main focus is the Coptic binding on the, uh, with signatures. I was bound and determined to learn how to do that. And uh, I think I probably made up my own way of doing it, but uh, nonetheless it worked.
Good morning, good morning, good morning. It has been a while since we have played on the table together. My desk is full of good ideas. <laughs> my floor is full of jibbles and bits. Oh my goodness. And uh, we're going to play with a small traveling collage um, book this morning. Um, this one has already been ordered and paid for. Uh, these are the covers that Rob made out of the um, pots, the plant pots uh, that he got from Trader Joe's that were being thrown away. These, we will go over these. These are the actual pages. Uh, here's my template to pop some holes in this cover, in both covers. I have leather on the back side of the metal book covers and I'm going to bring in my crocodile. I'm going to use the big hole although the template is has a small hole. Yes, the crocodile will go through the metal. So I have holes in the front cover and in the back cover, so these are ready to go. I bring all my pages in, nice messy pages. I love them. I don't pay too much attention as to whether the pages are upside down or not. They are going to be filled with goodies. Line them up. four signatures that I'm going to be playing with. Bring in a cover. Line that up pretty much where the pages are going to be. Remember it's a traveling junk journal. Okay, don't uh, stress too much. And then what I'm going to do is make a mark where those holes are going to be. For the binding. I have a lot of half pages and things like that. I do use my clips to keep it together. I put them down like this, keep, get them out of the way. Do have a sturdy page on the outside and sturdy pages on the inside so that uh, the holes and me tugging on the twine don't go through the fragile pages because they will. Bring my crocodile back in and pop holes where those marks are. and do that on each signature. Now I'll put a cover on the front and the back. And I will set up for my Coptic binding. So I will put the book, doesn't matter which is the front or the back, um, I'm going to put the book 
with the, we'll call this the cover, and the holes on the top, and the holes are facing away from me. Okay, put that under there for now. Well, I'm gonna set it off this off the screen. Sorry, just so that it stays together a little bit, I'm gonna use my tripod to hold that down. All right, bring in two blunt nose needles, some twine, about six feet. Doesn't take too much for this. Thread your needles. And the first thing we're going to do is bring our cover in, bring it toward us, and push that twine down through those holes. Now we're going to take time here and make sure that the twine is somewhat the same length on either side. Okay, give it a little tug. We're going to bring our first page, first signature in. And I'm going to put my needle through one, one side, one hole, and then out through the other. Take the one on the left side, my left side, push that in through that hole, and out through that one. clip. Sometimes the twine gets caught up on the clip. cover only. And I like to always stay inside the pairings. This is a pairing and this is a pairing. And I like to always stay inside those pairings. Make sure that's nice and tight. Bring in the next page. How'd you get away with no hole? side, out through the left side, in through the left side, out through the right side.
nice and tight. Now we're going to go down two signatures, one and two. We're going to go outside the signature, outside the pairing. We're going to bring that <laughs> bring that needle in and hug that pairing. All right, go around the outside of the pairing. And that's part of the book. Oh, there we go. All right, so that's called a link. Go down two on the right side. One, two. Go from the outside, hug that pairing. I just want to look into the front cover. Looks good. Nobody's where they're not supposed to be. Bring in the next signature. Let's take the clip off this one. In through the right. out through the left. In through the left. Out through the right. Pull tight. Pull tight. Go down two signatures. One, two. Start from the outside. Loop it around inside, the hug the pairings, one, two, outside, inside. Nice and tight. We have one more signature to go. Bring that signature in. Right side. Left side. Right side. and tight.
Go down two signatures, one, two. From the outside in, hug those pairings, one, two. Two signatures down. Beautiful. Beautiful. Bring the cover in. Bring a needle in, pull it up through the cover. This one feels a little bit awkward, but it's okay. We can tighten it up through the cover. Now we're going to go down to one, two, hug that pairing. As you can see, they're pretty tight, and I use my awl to bring that out so I can grab it. One, two. Nice tight cover. We're going to do that again. Go up through that hole. Up through that hole in the cover. Down two signatures, one and two. We've already done this. We're just making it a little bit more sturdy. One, two. Take those needles, put them inside the cover. When you have your needles on the inside of the cover, just go ahead and pull the needles off the binding thread, whatever you're using. Tie that off. So that's tied off on the inside of your cover. Everything's nice and tight. Have a binding, a Coptic binding here. Let's see if we missed any pages. Here's the front. That's linked. Second signature. That's linked third signature that's linked and the cover. Beautiful. 
All right, this traveling collage book really doesn't have a front or back. Some things are upside down, some things are right side up. That's the charm. These are some pages from my original um, little girl with painted hands. Um, these pages can be folded in for pockets, whatever the new owner wants to do with those. You can make all of the pages inside the covers if that's what you want to do. Have fun with it. This will be traveling with a, um, a glue stick and a little packet of goodies to be added to this traveling collage book. Glue stick, packet, traveling collage book. This is ready to go. This is ready to fly. All right, thank you so much for joining. Uh, it's been a while since I've been on the table. I've been purging. Uh, I have a dresser empty. I have a dresser and a half empty, actually, and still <laughs> still quite a bit of stuff to go through. So, um, yeah, thanks for joining today. Go create, go play, go have fun. All right, should we do it again? Holes in the cover. I have four signatures made with assorted papers from my table. I'm going to take the clips off for a minute. Line up the signatures best you can. That looks pretty good. Bring that cover in. Where do we want the holes? About right there. punch holes in all the signatures. I use my crocodile. You can use an awl. They don't have to be perfect. If they had to be perfect, I couldn't make them. Okay, four signatures, front cover, back cover, I'm going to put them 
like this. The coal holes away from me in the front cover or the back cover. It doesn't matter in these. I'm going to set them over here so that they stay together somewhat. Bring in my two needles, large eye, blunt nose. We used six feet last time. It was absolutely perfect. So let's just get a little bit more, shall we? in. I usually work from left, uh, from right to left, down through the cover, down through the cover. As you can see I had to uh, scrap the leather using what I have. I encourage you to do the same thing of course. Pull the needles so that they are about the same length. The threads are about the same length. Bring the first signature in. Right side in. Left side out. in, right side out. to the right side of the cover, poke that in the hole, just the cover, bringing that on the inside of the pairings. These are the pairings, inside the cover only, inside the pairings, keep that nice and strong. All right, let's check and see if it's tight. Look at the front page, make sure that that's good. Yes, it is. All right, we can walk forward. Bring the next signature in. I go right side in, left side out. Okay, that's better. All right, we're going to go down two signatures, one and two. Hug that pairing. Go 
from the outside to the inside. And this is what starts our Coptic binding. Outside, inside, one, two, outside, inside. And we're on our way. Right side in, left side out. Going to the left side, we'll go from the outside in. One, two signatures down. Hug that pairing. back on. <laughs> Bring in the fourth signature in the right side. I like them nice and tight. Artist choice. Down two signatures, one, two, hug the pairing. in, up through the cover on the right hand side, up through the cover on the left hand side,
down two. We're going to repeat that, come up through the cover only. Down two, hug the pairing, link it. Hug the pairing, link it. Take your needles, put them inside the cover. Maybe get breakfast soon. <laughs> Hear my tummy grumbling. You can remove the needles. it. This does not have to be too tight because, well you'll see, if you tie it too tight then it's hard to move the cover. Not that it won't stretch because it will, but you don't have to worry about this being too, too tight. Cut off the extra strings. If you choose, Course, always artist's choice. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful binding. Nice and tight. This will stretch. Fun papers, napkin maps. These are papers from my um, little girl with painted hands, one of the renditions. Beautiful. Looks good. This one's ready. The new owner can turn the pages in, make pockets, things like that. Some pages are upside down, some pages are right side up. I love that. The charm of it all. So, ta-da! All right, that was round two. Your turn. Go create, go play. Go have fun.